So Jim and I debated, should we do this video or not? You know, it's so substantive that I feel and important that we need to do it. It's going to be short, but let me ask you, how do you know when something is out of round? Now that's pretty important because there's a couple ways to check, there's a couple ways to feel, but do you really know if it's out of round? And what do we mean by out of round? Well, think about this. Supposing you have an ID, or let's talk about an OD. Here's our OD. And let's say that we need to put that, and we know that that's round. And let's say we need to put that inside of an ID of some sort. And that ID looks like this. Now, even though this will slip fit, let's say, and I've exaggerated this tolerance here, but this gap between here and here, just so we can get the, a clear understanding of what we're looking at. If you were to rotate this one, it doesn't matter what direction you rotate it this way or that way. It doesn't make any difference. If you rotated it, you're not going to feel any out around this. But something's out around, but you're not going to know it. How would you know if it were out around? The only way you would know that outside of trying to check for it, the only way you'd know, know it is if both were out around. So if you had one that looked like this and another one that looked like this, again exaggerated, it's going to be acting like a cam. You'll hear it go thump, 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 thump. You'll feel it in your fingers when you're rotating it. In this case, they're both out around. So in the first case, you wouldn't know if it's which part is out around. You would not know that. In this second case, you would know that both of them are out around. What do I mean by out around? I'm talking about a slip fit, folks. I'm not talking about something that's got an eighth inch clearance. That you can forget. You're just never going to know which part's out. But in a case of a slip fit, you will know. For example, here. We've got two diameters here, an ID and an OD, and that is a beautiful slip fit. And so is this side. Now, I know that in checking this by feeling it, it doesn't feel like it's out of round to me. How would I know if it's out of round? Well, I could check the OD by using a V block, and I'll show you what we're talking about. So we take a V-block, and by the way, we normally do this in a QC room, but it happens to be tied up at the moment, so uh, we understand that this is a Formica tabletop. It's not a granite surface plate, but that's okay. This is for demonstration purposes. We're not going to actually use this, but we're going to demonstrate the, the concept. So if we were to check... For out around this, it's easy to do. As you can see, that indicator is not moving at all. So we know that this part is not out around because we have two tangents down here on this 90 degree V block. And if it were out around, we'd be seeing a thump in there and it would show up on the indicator. So we know it's not out around. So we know that in this case, that this part is round. Let's say we wanted to check this diameter. We could do the same thing. And that would tell us if one or the other were out of round. And as you can see, it's just not moving at all. It's not moving 50 millions. So we know that that part is definitely round. So the, the, the value of this video, in my opinion, uh, is that you can actually feel if something's out around if you have two parts that made each other and you rotate them with your fingers and if it's a slip fit and you feel a little bit of a thump in there every time you go around both parts are out around if you don't feel a thump in there you could have one part out around you could have so you're going to have to check that to make sure that one of them or both of them are correct I think it's an important tip in dealing with roundness, and I think that that'll help you in any future 
uh, uh, checks that you have to make for out around us. So with that, thanks for watching and look out for some of our next videos that are coming up. Again, we got another field trip coming up, which I know you're going to find exciting. So if you like our videos, please mention it to your friends and subscribe. Thanks for watching.